Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Can you hear me? Yeah. Awesome. How are you guys? Hi, good evening. Pretty well, and you? Doing good too. What's your day today? Hey, actually, I was thinking about it. I I was in the in a run um, session because I was I was just how can I say I just me in the session. It was only you on the session. Yeah, at first. Wow. <laughs> Okay, guys, today is Wednesday, September 1st, Independence Day. It's very close. Are you having off? No. No. <laughs> I know, it was a joke. <laughs> that was a bad joke. Yes. <laughs> Okay. So you don't have any plans for Independence Day. So sad. So Working. Sad. Sometimes it feels so sad. Yeah. Working. There's no other way, man. Okay. So where were we? You remember where were we? No idea? Okay. Talking, talking about uh, run products. Run products. Oh, oh yeah. faulty. Faulty products. Faulty products. Um, yeah. Flop. Fluff. What was it? What was the word? Fluff? Flop? Flops. Flops. Oh, no. Clops. Product flops. Product flops. That's right. Okay. What do you remember? Mm, talking about what we can or what we will can what will I, do better in this context or if I were uh, the person in charge to promote the, the product what have been doing well well could have been Ooh. done. Could have been done. Huh? Yeah. Could have been done in order to prevent and the product failure, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. We will continue talking some about it. Okay. So before we move on, how many are we? Oh my God, we are seven. Anyways, let's do the attendance first, shall we? Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Claudia Marisela Solano Crespín. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martínez. Present. Thank you. Fátima Ifegenia López Ramos. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Good. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Antonio Cubillas Hernández. Present. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Where is Juan? Carlos Janet Amaya Herrera. Present, present, present. Thank you. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdez. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Roberto Luis Orellana. 
Roberto Luis Sumaño de Ariana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Sandra, Sandra, not here yet. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Thank you. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Okay, and Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Okay, guys, let's start. <clears throat> okay, I have a few questions for you. Okay. Just to remind you, let's see if you remember how to do this. What did you do last weekend? Easy. Okay. How's work doing? Natural questions. How's work doing? How's work doing? And finally, any plans for the weekend? Okay, any plans for the weekend? So we have three different questions. Simple past, how's work doing? What is that? What kind of sent, what kind of tense is that? How's work doing? Present continuous. Present continuous. Any plans for the weekend? Future. Simple future. present. You can use um, future, yeah. future. You can use future, yes, or present continuous as well. So let's do it, okay? Let's see, the first question. What did you do last weekend? Last weekend um, was great actually because I worked in the morning. I moved my schedule to the morning shift. So I worked from 5 a.m. to 12.30 on Saturday and I didn't fill the time. There were no calls, you know, it was chill. I had nothing to do. And at 12.30, I finished working and I went to the beach with my family so we spent there the whole afternoon in the evening we came back home we watched some movies <clears throat> we i believe we ordered pizza can't remember and on sunday um we stood home we did nothing well actually yes i repaired the roof i had a leak and i repaired the roof but spent most of the time on sunday with the kids that was amazing it was really good um <clears throat> How's work doing? Well, it's doing pretty good, actually. There is not much job, not much to do in the call center. Um, classes, I do have some classes, you know, and they're pretty good. Um, for the weekend, what are my plans? I'm, I'm planning to have another trip on Saturday, maybe. Just drive somewhere by myself. Oh, by myself driving. Um, maybe go somewhere and take some nice pictures. And on Sunday, I'm planning to do nothing. Sleeping, whole day. What about you? Okay. So let's get split it in three little groups. Practice repeating the questions to your classmates. Let's go. Okay. Hello. Okay. Okay, Fernando, what did you do the last weekend? The last weekend, I, mm, I got work every day <laughs> and I, I, I developed a new feature for uh, the application that I am working right now too. And I, I, I went to play soccer 
Do you play soccer? What is your position? Uh, I I play in the in center back or midfield. Oh, uh, defensive midfield. <laughs> Are you good? <laughs> <laughs> when oh, I was young, I I was good, but now I need a new knee. <laughs> okay, okay. Hey, what uh, kind of application is the more uh, familiar that you develop? I I worked in some application for example uh, get my foot do you know do you know get my foot no no i don't know three years ago uh -huh. i i was working in that app with um, some changes of interface and functionalities now i don't know what if the application is 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 in the same, is it mismo estado, same state, or they change the, the, the application, but uh, Santa Rosa, Santa Rosa, that, that is a app for, for the Condado Santa Rosa in Santa Tecla. Okay. And your extra mile sometimes in order to reach what you want no matter whatever it takes uh, professionally uh, when we are talking about uh, work but for me that is the the key i told you that hard working okay, and what about nice. you how to work well, doing well, actually, the last uh, month was terrible for me because I got a I got a medical appointment. Uh, who do you say incapacidad? I didn't I didn't remember remember that word. Disability. Uh, no, medically. Medical leave. Oh. Yes. You were on Incapacidad. medical leave. Incapacidad. Yes, you. I got a medical leave and my, my PA was not so good. Also, um, I was not so good on quality, but at this month I am doing my best since today, since this morning. I woke up and I say, come on, new month, I will achieve my goal right now. I will get the bonus this month. <laughs> so it's doing well. For the moment, it's doing well. Let's focus on something. TH. Month. 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 Okay. Month, 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 month. Focus on that. Any word that ends with TH, you say th. Mm -hmm. Good, good, good. Okay, perfect. Keep going, keep going. Okay, and Miriam, now did you hear me? Do you hear me? Sorry. Yeah. Okay, and Nelvin, okay. are you feeling good uh, right now? Yeah, so, sorry, uh, Miguel asked me, and, the, and I don't know what is the problem. My connection, sorry for that. Um, okay. Yeah, uh, in, in my case, uh, last last week, uh, there was uh, very busy because um, in the morning, on Saturday, I went to to work. Uh, I I uh, planned uh, the new conversion another product. Uh, there are uh, there are many activities because. Uh, Alan, Alan doesn't want to doesn't want to talk today. I think that he is he is looking. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know because he's not talking today. But well, what, what I will, what I will do. 
on this weekend. I think that the same work, work on Sunday and on Saturday. I think that maybe I'm going to to make the laundry. Do the Can laundry. I say that? Sir? Do the laundry. Do, do. do the laundry. Do, do the laundry. Yeah, but I don't know how I would do that since my do that because because my my um I don't know my um, machine my the, washing the machine my washing the machine, washing machine <laughs> the washing machine uh, is not working so maybe you're going to the river maybe I'm going to, no maybe I'm going to pay because I, I like it to to play by myself. We're losing you. It's my time off, so in this case, I need to sleep <laughs> or do something else. I'm on the supermarket now. In. Sometime he. Sorry. I'm in the supermarket. In the supermarket. What I said. On. On. I have a big issue with the I think we're, we're losing your in and on. I don't know why. So, uh, oh my God. Who else wanna talk today? I'm going to get cash there. Okay, awesome. I think that Alan is, is we're losing you. And we lost her. Uh, I, I, I couldn't mute her. Oh, we're, we're losing you. You're losing your connection, Isela. Um, okay, let's go back. Let's see if everybody participated. Okay, teacher. Okay, we're back. So I need two volunteers. Okay, one volunteer. Just one. You know what, I'll use this thing instead. Okay, uh, I need one volunteer. Don't be shy. Thank you, William Alexander, let's go. <laughs> you can do it, you can do it. Okay. Will yeah. Did I do last weekend? Um, okay. On Saturday, I worked in the morning from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. Uh, then I came back home at 1 p.m. I had lunch at 12, uh, 2 p.m. Then I took a nap. The whole afternoon, I did the laundry and I watched a movie with some friends. Um, okay, then on Sunday I went to Metapan and I spent the whole morning with them, with my family, and I came back home in the afternoon. After that, I did exercise, and that's it. Perfect. Okay. 
So how's work doing? How's work doing, William? Okay. Okay. How's work doing, William? Teacher, esa no la discutimos, lo siento. Oh, really? You didn't improvise. You can do it. What is the question? Sorry. How's work? <laughs> Sorry, at the same time. I know, I know. You're breaking up really bad. You said, uh, how's work doing? How's your job? Um, it is okay. It is really stressful for some times, but I am doing well. Easy. You see, you can do it. Last, any plans for the weekend? Any plans? Uh, maybe I am going to to somewhere, but I don't know. I don't to, know. <laughs> to go somewhere, but you don't know. Okay. Good. Okay. Just one more. Thank you. Now a volunteer. A volunteer to answer the three questions. This is a conversation, guys. Just giving you the chance to speak. William had no flaws, no areas of improvement. That was really good, actually. So come on. Someone else. Okay, Alan. What did you do last weekend? Last weekend, I went to Actually, it was a boring weekend because I didn't do anything. I stay in house, rest, and take a nap, use my famous hamaca, and, well, enjoy the time, read a book. Well, nothing special, just uh, take it easy. Okay, so you read a book? I read a book, yes. Okay. Actually, I have, I have been reading the book. I have been read the book. You... Because I, I read and I start again to, to read it. Okay, so and you I already read it. Right? Like, oh uh, you read you already I... you have read the book. Yeah, you have read so the book I already, think... but you're rereading. Yeah, that's uh, that's the word. word. You're rereading. Yeah. Okay. How's work doing? Um I know. So I, I, I don't have, can describe it because it, it begins awful. Though. The things I have to do, I hate and I'm not, I, I want to get out of my office. And I think everything changed. Everything was changes. happening. Everything changes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and the environment is not like happiest. Um, wow. Well, I. That's amazing that my boss says, hey, don't worry. Take uh, take all the time. Don't worry. <laughs> awesome. Suddenly, suddenly change. I don't, don't know how, what happened. Mm -hmm. It happened. Okay. That's good. Any plans for the weekend? Uh, actually, yes. For this weekend, I, I will visit the uh, train museum. Museo del Ferrocarril. Mm -hmm. um, spare time with my family with my son and well I'm I'm not sure if I, I think that museums are boring but I will give you another chance because I don't, I don't know what's happening you will After figure it on the way you will figure it on the way yeah we'll figure it on the way okay see Easy, simple. That's all it takes for you to talk. Okay, let's get into, let's hop into, let's hop into your topics on your books. So let's see, we're on page 21 already. Um, 
we have to organize a basic plan to run a focus group. We have to organize a basic, a basic plan to run a focus group, to test a product, a focus group. What comes to your mind with this word? What is a focus group? Can anybody enlighten me? Tell me what does that mean, a focus group? A group made of to replace a survey. Hmm. To replace a survey or to conduct um, to conduct a to survey. Get, to get information to to people. From from people? From people. Mm -hmm. a focus group. Okay. Yeah, that could be a survey with some employees. Anybody else? Thank you, Alexander. Anybody else? Carla Janet, Miguel. You're so quiet tonight, Johnny, Jose Antonio, Elvin. What comes to your mind when you hear focus group? Is the planification group? The planification group? Welcome, Adita. Thank you, welcome. <laughs> Yeah, the planification group. Okay, what else? What else? Isn't that thing all we are going to study? <laughs> okay, it's the thing that we're going to study. Yeah, that's what we're going to study right now. But what comes to your mind when you hear a focus group? A focus group. Okay. The, maybe the team who is going to evaluate the product. A team that is going to evaluate the product, a situation, a focus. A marker. <laughs> uh huh. So it's just that it's people getting together to talk about a specific topic. Okay. To discuss planning, to discuss options. Um, is there a way to predict? Is there a way to predict if your product will be accepted by the consumer? <laughs> Does this ring any bell? Does that ring any bell? Yeah. I told you this before, right? Does that ring any bell? Yeah, in the last module unit. <laughs> yeah. Last module. Module. Yep. Yeah. Does that ring any bell? What's the meaning, teacher? How will you translate that, Alexander? Does that ring any bell? Suena, me suena la campana. Me suena... Ah, ¿Te suena algo? ¿Te trae algún recuerdo eso? Uh -huh. Is there a way to predict if your product will be accepted by the consumer? Yesterday we talked about flop products, okay? Faulty products. How to prevent, or well, we were talking about different products that flood on their launch, why they, they were faulty, where, why they had some flaws. Okay, so is there any way to predict if your product will be accepted by the consumers? How can you predict? Yesterday's class. How can you predict if a product will fail? Testing it. Testing it. Testing it. Yes. You taste the product. You test the product. Okay. In what? parameters will tell you oh no man that guitar that guitar won't sell that computer won't sell that new coffee brand is not going to sell okay the image maybe and by image i mean um the presentation of the product the package the logo of the company Okay, would you like to be a product tester? As we spoke yesterday, would you like to be a product tester? Okay, uh, Isela was saying yesterday, yes, I would love to be a product tester for beds, right, to sleep on them. Have you heard about the term focus group? So these are three questions are the opening, the opening of our topic. Try to be, uh, try to speak as much as you can, ask your classmates 
you know, is there a way to predict if your product will be accepted by the consumer? I think so. I think, yeah, yeah, it's going to be difficult, but we have to test a product and based on the results, tell if the customers will accept it or not. Parameters, the price, the color, the size. Mm, does that, does the product solve any, does the product solve any necessity, any human necessity? Okay. If it is food, does that cover any human necessity? Okay. And so on. Would you like to be a product tester? Maybe it all depends on the product, right? Have you heard about the term focus group? So let's get split it again and please practice these three questions again. You have to speak. Today is our 10th day. Hoy es nuestro día número 10. So hoy cerramos la unidad 12 en teoría. And um, so far, hasta el momento, no, no los veo con el ánimo de, de estar est hablando, chicos. Y les recuerdo que a eso hemos venido acá. So, no matter what, we have to speak. Y siempre el día final de, de cada unidad es como un pequeño review o son preguntas muy frecuentes para armar conversación. Porque la finalidad de un curso de inglés es que tú hables inglés, no hablar español. Español ya sabes, right? So, and these are good topics. So, let's talk. You know what? I'm going to okay, make Okay, teacher. Okay. I'm sorry for this crazy life. It's okay. <laughs> Don't worry. Okay, let's get it done. Practice okay. with the questions there on your group. Hello, people. What's up, guys? Okay. What's up? What's up? What's up, Alan? Hi, Alan. What you are going to talk about? Um, some of you have, have, yeah, have. Okay. The book. Suddenly, in the groups I would uh, say before, was uh, the topic that top. What was like, the uh, page? Okay, I, I found it. Found let it. me let me share. Can you see it? Okay. What what kind of page are you are you seeing? Are you seeing Google seeing? Page. Okay. So Okay. 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 Is there a way to predict if your product will be accepted by the customer, Alan? Mm, right. Is there a way to predict the cheapest product? And then, I guess if you're, of course, is the first is you have to test the product, right? And after that, you can use a statistic method to, uh, to measure uh, how is the impact on the people, if they like it or not. But at the beginning, it was tested in someone, maybe a, a, a group. If they, for example, you say that 10 people, the 10 of them, or the group uh, A say A, there is a nice or great product, I guess it will be uh, acceptable. But it's my opinion. Okay. 
Would you like to be a product tester? Of course. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay. And have you heard about the term focus group? Focus group. Actually, I um, I I hear about that term, but I figured out that the focus group is like a, a certain number number of person that is chosen is was chosen for a determinate task. I don't know. I guess something like that. I'm not sure, but yeah, okay, good. What about Johnny? Is there a way to predict if the product will be accepted by the customer? Yeah, of course. So like, say, Adam, and the statistic can be held to predict if restaurant and uh, there, there is a, there is different and, and product. And, and for example, beverage and, and food and, and yeah. That's it. Simple idea. <laughs> but you try it, so it's good. Yeah. And what do you think, um, Carla, Janet? You can ask her the, the second question. Okay. Okay, next question. Would you like to be a public tester? Mm, I don't think so. Because if I if I don't know the product or it's a new product, it depends. But I don't like I don't like. Hey, what about um makeup? You don't like makeup? No. And uh, because if if I allergic. Uh, can uh, can for me can damage your skin? Uh huh. Yeah. My, uh -huh. my my skin. So uh, um, I I don't like. <laughs> uh, I I I think I, I think uh, I depend the product because mm -hmm. uh, yeah because is the is the food, for example, uh, the 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 new product? Uh, I I would like to to uh, a a product test because tester. <laughs> tester, sorry, so yeah, tester because uh, give me uh, give me a a promotional or give me a a free food, for example. I I like it, but uh -huh. depend what it. But depending what is that? Yeah, uh -huh. what is a pro? I think. Full? But, yes. Full? Yeah, full is okay. <laughs> but, <laughs> it's, but it's a, for example, um, let me see. Um, uh, uh, use in the thing. Uh, crema. I don't know. I don't remember what is crema. Body Body cream. Cream. Yeah. Or, for, for, for this for this product I don't like. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And Isela? Would you like? Which product? I don't know. Whatever, mm. whatever product. Yeah. Um I think that as um, Elvin was 
Diane is the friend of the part of the girls. Um, yeah, it's full. Yeah, I can. I can taste. Taste. I can yes, taste if it. it is food, you taste it. Very good. Yeah. I can taste it. Maybe uh, later I'm going to buy the um, intestinal medicine. I don't know, but <laughs> yeah. we can try. Yeah, and and I would like to test like makeup products because sometimes uh, you can get a free makeup. <laughs> so for that reason, and to be honest, I. Sorry. Sometimes, um, actually, I don't use makeup in my daily routine, but I would like to to learn how to uh, make makeup by, by by myself. Okay, that is a good way. So I think that would be a good idea to get a a free um free, free, free a free makeup. Yeah, they can test for me. Okay. And let me check. What is the question that is missing? Have you heard about the term focus 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 group? Yeah. Is it going to be for Fernando? Yeah. What? The number the number three. Uh, uh, yes, I have. Uh, I, I I have heard about the term, the term, and I remember that that is a, a group of customers. For example, in this context, uh, the customers uh, are from different. Uh, a kind of of for example, kind of uh, uh, really? categor categories or a uh, uh, product name, for example, and they discuss about the products about a a, a, a specific brand and with their with their opinions, uh, the the companies get feedback about their opinions so they they can they can predict the the accept the predict the a product will be accepted in, in base of the their opinions or their experience when they they have they they have a, a group a group focus a focus group and the focus group uh uh, they they done uh, what is it? meet meet uh, uh, once they they have to meet in many many times because that is a process but in different phases I think I think and did that okay. <clears throat> Recording stop. Okay. Um, let's just wait for the others. Any thoughts about your conversations? Any thoughts? Mm -hmm. Any thoughts about your conversations? Well, I was thinking about it that testing product is the key to the success of the company because success. if success to the company, because if you are able to predict you about your products, you are going to get profit for your company. And otherwise you can get ruined 
ruin, right? Ruined. Uh -huh. Ruin for your for your business. You can ruin your business. Your business. You right? can ruin your business. Okay. True. Someone else? Second thoughts. Hello. Mm, for uh, a better a better testing, you can combine different techniques of testing. It depends. It depends on the product. Okay. That's what you said on your group. Okay, now, nowadays, think about how the world has evolved in technology and everything. Hmm. Do you think companies are still testing products? Yeah. Yes, of course they do, but how? Uh, usually I think uh, that, that the companies hire uh, an, an agency for doing that because uh, an agency agency for an doing agency that. for testing products yes that's a thought that's a thought outsourcing good what do you think Jenny is it common have you heard Jenny about any company sending products for you to test yeah of course amazing Macy's are com medicine are common. Uh, oh. Some doctors receive uh, medicine. Some doctors receive medicine. Yeah. Medicine mm -hmm. with the objective to give the pas patient. Patient. For, patient. 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 Uh -huh. for patient. Patient. With the reason to get information about the about the product, it's mm -hmm. acceptable and it's yeah. good. I mean, they need someone to criticize their product before they launch it, right? That totally makes sense. Yeah, uh, Jocelyn, sure. Jocelyn, have you heard of any website or company giving products for free? Mm, not really, teacher, but I have heard that supposedly Apple uh, when they are uh, when they had the new iPhone, supposedly they send the iPhone to maybe to influencer or to uh, famous people to try the phone before launch the the iPhone. Before launching. I have heard that, but before launching, yeah, launching sorry. Death. But wow. I don't know is is it will be true, but it would be nice to have an iPhone before the the launch. <laughs> yeah, even if it explodes. It <laughs> yes, but I will in my case will be hey, welcome. Let's talk about an untangible product that you are always given for free for a couple of days. Okay, these are the clues. It's a free product you can get for about seven days. Okay. The entrepreneur, entrepreneur in this field used to give one month for free. So you can try. A trial. trial. A trial period. Repeat, trial period. Trial period. There's a trial period. Uh -huh. Just a period. Mm -hmm. Period. Period. Very good. What is it? What is it? They used to give one month. Now their competitors are giving just seven months for you to try it. What is it? Like, uh, the, like some platforms like Netflix and Netflix. Spotify. Yes. yes. Netflix, Spotify, Disney. Streaming. Mm -hmm. Streaming. Disney Plus and Disney, uh, wait, it's called Stars Plus. Disney just launched yesterday their new platform, which is Stars Plus. 
And now you can pay almost $14 a month. But guess what? They removed all of the programming from Netflix. What? That was a Is hit. For real? It's for real. They that was a hit. Man, did you know that Disney owned a lot of channels? A lot of channels. It's not just Disney channels. They own food channels, sport channels. They they own Are adult adult channels. Disney owns actually, adult channels. Mm -hmm. Actually, they, they are getting crazy because if you can see, uh, first we have the Disney channel and Disney um, app. And now you can find also the HBO um, app. Everybody. And there are some many, yeah. And you have to pay if you have to, if, if you would like to, to see in a specific series, you have to buy for for that series, and, and then maybe you are not going to to continue using that app because there are not many series that are in your best interest. So I think that is kind of crazy because they are removing some movies from Netflix and some series too. A lot of series. Now, I have a question for you. Do you think that TV channels will be removed one day? Will TV channels stop existing? Yes, what can be possible? Could be, could be. <laughs> you were like, oh my God. <laughs> Actually, they, they are doing that because they are restricting some access to some movies and some programs, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I and think. They have a great uh, start. Maybe you, you can replace the, the channels about uh, entertainment. How uh, do you say novelas? How do you say novelas? Soap operas. Soap opera. Soap opera. Soap opera. That kind of program. But the, 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 with, with the internet, uh, we have a lot of work for replacing the, the, the sports channel because the delay of the matches are very important. And if, for uh, and on internet we have uh, uh, a high delay with no, the sports. No, yeah. listen, that is the plus of a Star Plus. You have like twenty channels of sports, ESPN, and so many, and you can watch the replay. You can watch the replay of a match on the Stars Plus. It's it's crazy. Google it. I mean, go to YouTube. Yes, and, yes, but but I I refer about the the live the, the live matches live, live matches. matches. Uh, when you I I I am watching a match on internet. I have approximately approximately a delay of one minute in in TV. Oh, of course, yeah. I have only thirty seconds. So for me. Yeah. That is the, the, that yeah, is the... you got a point. You got a point. Totally. Yeah. Totally. Okay. Man, that is crazy to think. Hey, that happened. That happened with radio. Yeah. Video killed the radio stars. Video killed the radio stars. What's, what's that? <laughs> the first video played on MTV when MTV was launched. Irony. It was a, such an irony. The first video that MTV played when they went live on TV, they played video killed radio stars. <laughs> That's general culture, eh? general culture. If you ever go to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire with Willy Maldonado, <laughs> what was the first video ever played on MTV? The teacher's here. <laughs> you won't remember the words, okay? <laughs> so that was funny. Okay. Hey, products die. Products die. Products are developed. Others replace them. Computers, technology, right? It changes. Everything changes. We die. Okay. Something better is coming. And that's life, right? So the same happens with products. Okay. Whoa. That was a nice topic to talk. 
So can you predict if your product will be accepted by the consumer? You have, at this point in history, you have so many parameters to take a look at. One of you were, were saying on, on the groups, hey, you know, um, we can compare the product with other experiences. Totally. At this point, there's nothing that hasn't been invented. So you can compare. Okay. Very good. Let me do the attendance before we move on because so we, we don't have any interruption. Okay. About testing a product. What did you think about testing a product? There was a group on the 80s called, uh, on the 90s, I'm sorry, Crash Dummies, Crash Dummies. No idea? No idea. Do you know what is a crash dummy? A, a crash dummy is a tester. A crash dummy is a tester. Have you, did you know that they test cars before they sell you a car? The car went through a collision test. A collision test. So inside the vehicle, there's a little crash dummy, a doll, un muñeco de pruebas, a crash dummy. Would you like to be a crash dummy? <laughs> All right. Okay. No. Thank you. Okay, guys. Come on. Cheer up. Let's do the attendance so we can go with the reading. Ada, Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present teacher. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Alan Christopher Abreu Urizuela. Present. Carolina Ivette. Romero Avelino. Claudia Maricela Solano Crespin. Elvin Arcides Eguizabal Martinez. Present. Thank you, Fátima y Fegenia López Ramos. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Present. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Carla Yanet Amay Herrera. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Thank you. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Thought I saw Sandra somewhere. No. Okay. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Reina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. No. Okay. Okay, guys, let's continue. Now we have a conversation. Let's do it together. Hey, let's repeat until you can do this perfect, okay? I know you can do it. So I'm gonna read it first and then I'll let you read it. Let's, let's look for perfection. Tengo una pregunta para ustedes que me gustaba y creo que no se las he dicho hasta ahorita. ¿Existe la perfección? No. no. Man, so straight to the point. ¿Seguros? Yeah. <laughs> Depende, ¿de qué depende? Según cómo se mire. Dos veces perfección. Well, Tell yeah, me. We had to define the perfection. ¿Qué es la perfección entonces? Yeah. Perception. Una percepción, una ilusión. Ok, sí, 2013 me dice un profesor, no, 2000, a ver, 2010, ajá, 2010 me dice un profesor de, de la ingeniería industrial, física 2 creo que era, por eso me salí. Nos dice, ¿creen que existe la perfección? Y nosotros, sí, sí existe. No, señores, no existe, nos dijo al final de tanto insistirle. ¿verdad? Sacó una resma de papel, la abrió y la puso enfrente de nosotros. A ver, pasen, nadie, sin que se muevan las hojas. Ah. 
Y todos, vaya, ok. ¿Estaban parejas las hojas? Sí, perfectamente cortadas con una guillotina. Pero les claro. aseguro que si ustedes la ponen debajo de una lupa, de un uh, microscopio de la orilla de la página, ustedes van a encontrar... Exacto, no existe la perfección. Y a mí se me ocurrió algo. No existe la perfección. La perfección es una ilusión. Sí, perfecto, solo Dios. Sí. Pero no existe la perfección. Sin embargo, es una ilusión que merece la pena que la sigas. O sea, la perfección es una ilusión que vale la pena seguir tomando en cuenta que no existe. Esto va a hacer que tú des tu máximo esfuerzo. Tratar de ser perfecto en todo lo que hagas. ¿oí? Te va a hacer mentalizarte que tienes que dar tu mejor esfuerzo, pero no puedes perder de vista que no existe para evitar la frustración después. ¿sí? Entonces, lucha todos los días por ser perfecto, sabiendo que no lo vas a lograr nunca y eso va a evitar que te frustres. You did your best. Hiciste lo mejor. Y al final, ¿sabes? No esperes nada. La vida te va a dar todo, así por añadidura. Alguien siempre está observándote y, y, y viendo cómo haces tu trabajo y todo. Te lo digo por experiencia. La cosa es que tú hagas lo mejor que puedas y tarde o temprano alguien se fije. Pues este se mata haciendo tu trabajo. Yo no le pido que haga esto y sin embargo, vuela. No, no voy a ascender mejor. <risa> wow. Así me pasó a mí. Me dijeron, necesito du duplicarte. Así de que, venite. <risa> Yo was like, what? <risa> Tenemos que clonarte. Súper bueno que tu jefe te diga eso. Ojalá que les pase algún día. So let's go. Ahorita necesito que me, me imiten. Ok. When we do this specific part. Ok. So let's do it together. I will read it first. Don't say anything. Just try to repeat for yourself. And then you check the video. If you want to repeat, repeat, repeat again later. Let's take a look. Have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Focus groups. Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. To collect accurate results. Will we work with targeted, targeted or random samples? Will we work with targeted or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of each, and the location of each. You're right. You're right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. Furthermore, I hate that word. Furthermore, it's necessary. It's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire. I said questionnaire to get the specific to get this specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon. So we work on it. So we work on it. Okay, I'm gonna read it one more time. Intonation is very important. So first you articulate, first you articulate, and second you intonate. Have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. Will we work with targeted or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You're right. Because we want to find out the overall per perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. Furthermore, It's necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Simple, okay? I need two volunteers. Say me and your name, please. Me, Alexander. Okay, me, Alexander, and who else? 
Mi Fernando. En mi Fernando. Mi Alexander y mi Fernando. One, two, three, action. Have you been any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? <clears throat> sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. We will work with targeted or random samples. In addition, we need to discuss, we will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You're right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. For more, it is necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Good, okay. Again, it's not about speed, it's about articulation. Articulation, Remember? okay. Articulation. Articulation. <laughs> That's the problem, the U, okay? It sounds like U in English, not like ooh. Artic <laughs> <laughs> Be careful. Articulation is a groups. In this case, you kill the O. Okay, you say groups. Ahí le jugó una pasada el cerebro Alexander. Decía groups. Groups. Ok. Intonation. Results. La uso en la O en este caso. Results. The results. Accurate results. There. Ok. And again, we, here we say addition. No, addiction. Addiction is something else. In addition. Addition. In addition. Ok. A, here, the A sounds like an O, so you say overall, overall. Overall, overall. Por eso los overoles que ocupaba cuando estabas pequeño, los overoles, sobre todo. Ok. Mm -hmm. Overall. Overall. Uh -huh. Y decíamos, tráeme el overall. <laughs> ok. The afternoon, the article, T-H-E, goes before a vowel, so you say, so you say, the the afternoon the got it got it okay let's see if you got it let's practice really quick please talk to your classmates we are 15 let's make trios let's go First up, we are one and two, three, right? Yes. Someone can share the, the conversation, please. Uh, can I do that? <laughs> I don't have the book on my laptop. Don't worry, I'm sending it to you right now. Okay, thank you. you. You're an amazing teacher. Oh, you come are. on. <laughs> <laughs> I have no money, <laughs> Alan. <laughs> yes. You're the best. Okay. Um, okay. Have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Okay, sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. Will we work with targeted or random samples. In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. You are right, because we want to find and out the it. overall perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. Oh, 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 oh. Furthermore, it's necessary to create a well-designed 
questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I met Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Perfect. Okay. Now, William. Okay. I will do. I go first. Have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? Alan, continue. You will be Fernanda. <laughs> there, come on. We will have three groups of last 24 participants to collect accurate results. Will we work with targeted or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitored monitoring each groups each group uh, in the location of each you're right we want to find out the overall perception of the product we will go for another sample for furthermore it's necessary to create a well designed questionnaire to get the specific information we we require I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. I'll meet, I'll meet. I'll meet. I'll meet yeah. Lucas. Oh, I'll meet. Uh, we need to discuss who will be monitor monitoring. Monitoring. Group, monitoring the group and, and the location of each of each. You're right, because we want to find all the overall perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. For furthermore, is correct? Furthermore. 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 It's, it's necessary to create furthermore. a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. <clears throat> I, I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so so we work so we work on it. Okay. Okay. Fernando. Okay. Furthermore. Okay. Uh, I am uh, Moises. <laughs> Who is? <coughs> I don't need to rest. I am Fernanda. Okay. Uh, okay. Have you, okay, have, have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? Sure, Moises. We will have three groups of at least 24 participants to collect accurate results. Accurate. Accurate. Accurate, accurate results. Results. Okay. Accurate results. Uh, will we work with targets or targets con de verdad? Targeted. We work with targeted or random samples. In addition, we need to discuss who will be mo monitoring each group and the location of each. You're right, because we want to find to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go for a random sample. Furthermore, it's necessary to create a well designed, designed, no, designed, no, designed, no, designed, designed, no, you were fine, designed, ah, designed, okay, well designed, questionnaire, 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 ever. questionnaire, mm -hmm. questionnaire, to get the specific information we require. I met Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Change. change, change, change. Okay. Have you made have have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? Sure, Moises. We we will have three groups of at least twenty four participants to collect accurate results. 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 Accurate results. results. Accurate results. Okay. Will we work with targeted or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group. Who want to wear? Uh, yeah, okay. 
How you make any progress? <laughs> How you make any progress with the sample selection for the focus groups? I just I just want to no no no. I think that if I made a mistake, he is going to correct me. Okay. Sure, my says. Uh, we will have three groups of at least 24 participants participants to collect accurate results. We will we will sorry. Will we work with targeted or random samples? In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of it. You are right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product. We will go for a random, random sample. Furthermore, it is necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require. I'll meet, I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. Have you made any progress? Have you made any progress with the sample selection for the focus group? Sure, my said. We will have three groups of at least twenty-four participants to collect accurate results. We we work with the target teacher. Targeted. Uh, is target or targeted? Target. Targeted or random targeted. samples. Targeted or random samples. In addition, we need to discuss who will be monitoring each group and the location of each. Right, because we want to find out the overall perception of the product, we will go for a random sample. Easy. Mm -hmm. Furthermore, it is necessary to create a well-designed questionnaire to get the specific information we require it would meet Lucas today in the afternoon, so we work on it. I'll meet. I'll meet Lucas today. Sorry? Repeat. repeat. I'll meet Sandra today. I'll meet? I'll meet your mom today. I'll meet. I'll meet. I'll meet. I'll meet. I'll I'll meet. meet. I will meet. <laughs> uh -huh. I'll, I'll meet I him today. It's easier. it's easier to say I will. No, that, try to that, say it. I'll meet him today. All? Like I'll, all. Like, como a -L, I'll. I'll. I'll meet him. I'll meet him today. I'll meet him today. I'll meet him today. No, I'm sorry. Try. I'll, meet, I'll meet him today. See, you got it. I'll meet him today. I'll meet him today. No problem. Okay. Meet him today. Got it. Let's yeah, go. there's a problem. <laughs> oh. It's not working. One, two, one, two. Press Alt A. Okay, so if I go Alt A. Okay, if you remember, at some given point, I send you something. I send you a website where you could check the, um, the pronunciation of any word that you couldn't find, right? The name of the website was Juglish. I don't know if you still use it or if you're looking for other things to improve your pronunciation. I think English is always a good option. Uh, da, 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 required. I heard you saying, miss saying, oh, this word, furthermore, furthermore. Let's see if I'm right or I'm wrong. Furthermore. So we're one for eight. 
Furthermore, while geothermal energy is clean and renewable, it's not entirely okay. Furthermore, furthermore Gödel argues. Furthermore, the solution is feeding the problem. Furthermore, the political activist and conservative. Furthermore, people. Fur furthermore, communicate them liberally. Furthermore, furthermore, there's a host of cafes and. Furthermore, if there are fewer people with. Her? Furthermore. So for further, further, furthermore. Okay, furthermore. Targeted. I was giving you some headaches. Targeted. Is ED ended? So yeah, let's see. Targeted. Third, we strategically deploy them in a targeted formation at the most mission critical and when it should be more specifically targeted at the needy. Using this information these days, um, a bit like we have to be a targeted immune system. Targeted. The Inquisition targeted different. Targeted. These drugs targeted several different. Sounds better, right? Targeted. Targeted. And that's it, targeted. I think. Any targeted. other difficult? Accurate. Sounds right. Accurate focus. I'm curious about this word because some of you are saying focus still is not focus, it's focus. Okay. Listen. Focus. We should never Correct. lose focus of that. Focus. Growing of focus, right? We are told that. Focus. So while it's good to remember the progress we've made because that tells us when we focus on it, remember the progress we've made because that tells us when we focus on it, we can do right because that tells us when we focus on it. You see, punk kids. <laughs> Who was it? Obama. You're right. Mr. Obama, right? Okay. Hey, I love his pronunciation. It's really good. Okay, let's keep going. What's up next? Next, we have to continue with the conversation and answer the questions down below the conversation. Okay, so you need to read the conversation again and discuss the answers to the questions below with a partner. So in teams again, in trios, how many focus groups will participate in the test? What type of sample has Fernanda selected for their testing process? And who will design the questionnaire? This is just three questions. Let's give, let's give it six minutes and we come back, okay? Just these three questions give them an answer and it's about the reading. So don't just answer, talk to your classmate. Hey, what do you think? Si crees que ya sabes la respuesta, deja que tu compañero que tal vez creas que le cuesta un poquito más, de, deslumbre la, la respuesta, okay? That's the whole point. Let's recreate the groups and let's get together. Hey. How many focus? How many focus groups? We can focus. How many focus? How many focus groups will participate in the in the test? Three groups. <laughs> three groups. I think. Three groups. Three groups. What yes, side of, of the sample has Fernanda select for the testing process? Oh. Mm -hmm. oh Twenty-four. Mm, no. No. Time of sample has Fernanda select for because 24 participants to collect the cube. So this is another. So you may enter with the sample question. Random sample. Yes. 
They will go for a random sample. They use um, that met random sample. Yes. This is one. We we will go for a random sample. Fernanda, when Fernanda say we will go for a random sample. What time? One. The singular. We will go for a random sample. I think that is the answer. It's a option. Option. She must sure what time. What time of sample? As when I said for you to. The overall perception of the product. Yeah. We want to find out the, out the overall perception of the product. Yes. We will go for random sample. Yes, we will we will go for a random sample. No, no, no. I mm. I, I think that is uh, the sign questionnaire to get the specific information required. Mm. <laughs> I confused mm -hmm. me. Who will design the questionnaire? Yeah, the answer is in the question number three. Design the questionnaire. This is the... Yeah. Good thing, Johnny. In number two, in number two, you are not sure what happened. Or or number three and number two. Number two, what type of sample has Fernanda selected for their testing process? Uh, she will say a random, random sample. Sample. Sample because she's not sure. And Randall is not ha, has uh, met for this shoes, something. Mm. I don't understand. <laughs> yeah, I, I think that is the question, mm -hmm. Yeah. The other is the question, And the next, who will decide the question, um, both. Lucas. Lucas? Both. Moisés and Lucas. Yeah, Lucas. I think that is Moisés and Lucas. It's correct, teacher, the number two. The answer, the answer is questionnaire. Forget it. Forget no. <laughs> How many? No. Um, what type of sample has Fernanda selected for their testing process? But it says uh, Moses. Okay. Moses asks, "Will we work with targeted or random samples?" And then she says, "You're right because we want to find out the overall perception of road. We will go for a random sample. Mm -hmm. so they will go for a random sample, not at not a targeted sample." Okay. I want you to discuss what is a targeted sample and what is a random sample. Okay. Where is the random? Um, random. Yes, and in oh. now I understood. Okay, thank you. <laughs> yes. We were touch. Sorry? <laughs> the teacher is not out. We, we here. Would you tell me if they work in Canada? Can you work. tell me? Oh, you're saying call you, call you, tell if 
Isn't it? Could you tell if they work in Canada? We say it. Oh, I can. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I'm. I'm so exhausted actually. <laughs> but it is what it is. If they work in Canada, can you tell me if? Can you tell me if they work? Okay. Um, what exercise is that? 3.3? Okay. Today is the last day to, to do the homework. Yep. Right. Yeah, for the, for the second unit, right? This, yes, that's right, for the second unit. I believe okay. we are having to have, uh, we need to have the, um, the midterm test as well later. I'll let you know. Hey, did you practice the conversation? I mean, the questions, did you respond to the questions? Yes. Yeah. What do you, what do you understand by, sorry, there was something here. So um, what type of samples has Fernanda selected for their testing process? The random sample. The random sample, okay. I had a question for you. Um, yeah, what do you understand by targeted or random samples? Targeted and random samples means actually targeted is to conduct or handle a specific group and or product. And random is random, aleatory. Aleatory, aleatory, <laughs> yeah, specific word. Yeah, that's what it is, right? You have a specific uh, profile of person that you're targeting, you're targeting for a specific type of person that you want to run the test on, totally. Very good. Okay. Good. Okay, let's go back. Okay, I think we're back, right? So, okay, um, someone someone already responded to this question, don't do it again. Okay, Alexander, don't give me the answer, but I want to know in general, uh, Miguel, for example, Ada, Alan, I don't know. What do you understand by targeted or random samples? Target is how uh, objectives specific or goals specific. Specific okay. objectives, specific, specific goal, goals. Specific. Uh -huh. Yeah. And random is when you have the different option for for being for being chosen, for example. To be chosen. Uh, um, be chosen. Choose. You have different options chosen. to choose. You have different options to choose from. Okay. So targeted sample, hmm. a targeted sample is a profile, right? You already have a profile of person that you are targeting, okay. that you're aiming to. Uh, for example, if you want to test, listen, if you want to test a shampoo again, a shampoo, a targeted, a targeted sample could be only men, just for men, just men from 40 to 60 years old, between 40 and 60 years old, okay? That's your targeted sample. 
a random sample will be the opposite. You have women, you have uh, men of any ages, you know, the ages don't matter, it's just any person. And that's a random sample. How do you test? And that's different. Remember, we saw the different types of tests, the monadic test. What else do you remember? Just test, <laughs> handling and blind, blind, blinding, blinding, blinding the blinding test, the blinding test. test. The, the, question, question. Um, the question monadic. The monadic, uh huh. And the other one was the. Um... Used to... No, no, no. The... Sign handling test. Sequential. Sign handling sequen... test. monadic sequential monadic test. Don't no, wait. The question What's... by method. Ah, is it sequential? No, 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 no. Monadic sequential method. Monadic. Sequential monadic method. Thank monadic you, Alexa. So yeah, do you have and, and do you have the pair comparison test? So many tests. Pair comparison. So right. But who is going to be tested? Who is going to test the product? So that's your sample. Your sample is not your product. Your sample is the let's say the targeted niche of market and I, I keep saying that word i'm sorry is your targeted niche of market so for example if you are testing a new bike what do you think if you're test testing a new bike will you test it on very old people no, no. why for no ah, because the 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 majority of the of the person that can ex, ex come say sexy here how do you say it mm, can demand can demand the capacities of the bike is a younger man oh, because it's it's youth uh, teenagers are yeah, teenagers. youth or teenager okay uh huh because if you sell a bike for a, a all the older person, they use their but moderate, calm, calm down. They only mm, on the moderated, right. moderated, very good. And mm -hmm. a, a young, a young man or a teenager, uh, they uh, it, it's going be it, it's going to to try the bike in a right. mountain or yeah. I mean, the 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 more extreme you go, the better. That's your point. Yes. Okay, the more extreme you go, the better. Okay, hmm. totally. I agree with you on that point. So yeah, the product has to be tested by the targeted audience, targeted <laughs> customers. Now, when can you apply a random test then? A random test. A random sample, I'm sorry. When, when can you use a random sample to test your product? Think about a product that you can test with Food. anybody. Food. food. OK, if it is a spicy food. Mm, no. no. Only for Mexican. Mm. Just, for, just for Mexican. Let's try to use just. Just for Mexican. Any other? A camera, a cell phone, cell phone, games. What, Alex? Games. Games. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that will be a good variable. Okay, and so you can build a profile if you want to be more specific of the person, the type of person that you want a sample from. And for example, I could hire only gamers to test the game. And that is what they did with a game called Crisis. Have you heard of that game, Crisis? No? It's a, it's yes. a, it's a computer game, right, Fernando? They tested all the features of the game, but you needed the best graphics cards, the best processors, the best memory, the best everything. And they tried it with all the features of the game and some computers didn't support the game. Um, see, 
So yeah, it all depends on the targeted market. Okay. Were you able to answer the questions? What type of test do they decide to apply? Targeted and random sample. Targeted sample? Okay. Uh, random sample. Like... The random sample? The random sample. Why? Both. Both? <gasps> I'm uh, not really sure. Ah, no. <laughs> come on, <laughs> defend your posture. Hey, come on, is it random or or test or uh, targeted? Here we go. Uh, this is another conversation. This is another conversation. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Hold on. Yes, that is. <laughs> yeah. How many? I'm sorry. How many focus groups will participate in the test? Three. Three. Group. Three. How many groups? Three groups. Three groups. Three groups. Three groups. Why? Group. Because Fernanda said we will have three groups of at least 24 participants. To collect accurate results. Okay. I'm with you on that one. What type of sample has Fernanda selected for the testing process? Random. Random sample. And why? Fernanda said, we will go for a random sample. Both. We will are go right? for a random sample. Why are you saying both, random. Alex? Oh, uh, so, sorry. Yeah, it's random. Yeah, go it's random, it. right? Yeah, we, we, because we want to find out the overall perception, the overall perception. It's not the specific perception of a group. It's just everybody. Okay. Who will design the questionnaire? Moises and Lucas. Moises and Lucas. Okay. Last paragraph, right? The last paragraph is I'll meet Lucas today in the afternoon. So we work on it about the questionnaire. Very good. <clears throat> okay. Now you're supposed to discuss a case and explain it to the class. Give me just a minute. This thing was working before. Allow me just a second. That is not working anymore. Okay, so your mission right now is to follow the example uh, that I was giving you based on the lesson plan. So discuss about product development in this sense, um, what will be better for testing a product? What kind of sample? Ahora quiero saber, todos estamos entendiendo a qué nos referimos cuando hablamos de un sample, right? A qué nos estamos refiriendo, al producto? No, producto. Test. Yeah. A test. Yeah. Miguel dice a test. No, customers. Ajá. En este caso, consumers. Mm -hmm. Consumers. The last uh, person that will use the product, right? Estamos hablando de la última persona que va a utilizar el producto. So, ese es mi ejemplo. Um, mi sample. Right? Eh, lo mismo ocurre con las encuestas. Las encuestas de opinión popular suelen captar la, la información real, es decir, es, ¿qué tan verídica puede ser una encuesta? Si te has puesto a pensar en eso. It depends on the sample. Yeah, if you have 10,000 people, let's say you have a survey with 1 million Salvadorians. Si tienes una encuesta con un millón de salvadoreños, ¿qué tan accurate será? ¿Qué tan real será la muestra. Un millón de salvadoreños. Fernando sigue, no, no, no. Not a good sample. 
It's too much. It's too much. Can it be accurate? Uh, Is it real? It's more subjective than that objective. That's a great point. It's more subjective than objective. Hmm. What if I say these million Salvadorians are between 20 and 30 years old? The, 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 and, the they sample, all work, and they all better. work. <laughs> That's, Maybe it's getting better. It's getting better, more accurate. Okay. Todos trabajan, tienen entre 20 y 30 años y son un millón salvadoreños. Wow. Okay. Is that a, that's a good example. It's a good sample. I'm sorry. It's a good sample. Pero estoy exagerando. Okay. So it all depends on the amount of people that test the product. So I want you to think, quiero que penses en dos productos y la discrepancia entre ellos. Que pintes dos ejemplos prácticamente eh, contrastándolos, ¿no? Solo Habla en tu grupo sobre eso. Dos productos, uno que se pueda probar con una targeted sample y uno que se pueda probar con una random sample. ¿Ok? ¿Si ¿Sí tiene sentido? Recuerda el ejemplo que te he dado. Ok. Uh, Johnny, please, 10 minutes after the class. Ok. Cuando les digo así, siento que okay, Johnny a la dirección. Ok. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I'm sorry. Voy a hacer lo que hace este tipo, el gordo Iglesias en YouTube. Priceless. ¿No han visto a Enrique Iglesias? No, ¿cómo es que se llama? No me acuerdo. Un gordo fluffy. No, ok. Where is it? Ok. No, ok. Let's go. Gabriel Iglesias, I remember. Let's go. <laughs> we have to choose two products for the target sample I think we can choose um, a video camera but a uh, professional video camera camera Oh, the common camera. Okay, like need to create a profile like students for uh, students can be a good multi option. Multimedia for multimedia creators makers like the the. the the person that creates the publicity uh, for marketing for, for the, their companies. I don't know. Hmm. Or if you are you're thinking that the way guitars, well. guitars, a guitar. Is a comparative the liquid? <laughs> for yes. target sample, guitar. For example, I don't like guitar. I, I am not uh, a good element for trying that. So, what about piano? Piano can be piano a is very, very specific. Very specific people like it, like that. Or can be it's a random fun. as well because can use for children, but young people, and use for church, <laughs> for partition, no, actually, partition for for mm. yeah. Yeah, no, it's, no, it's, it's, it's going to be a, a hobby. A, a new computer is a, a excellent example for a random sample. Mm. All people can cannot use computer actually. The yes, most the uh, computer actually. We we have the a big universe of 
persons that use that. That could use it. That could use people. it. The people you... And after Running pandemic, more. After yeah. the after the whole pandemic, I escucho que los americanos dicen pandemic. mucho eso, fíjate. After the whole pandemic, pandemic, after this whole pandemic, everything is going to hell. If, after this whole pandemic. Why are you using that? For emphasis, Después de toda esta pandemia. Gran pandemia. Después de esta gran pandemia, después de esta esta cosa de la pandemia, así lo ven ellos after this whole pandemic thing se quejan mucho de eso y tienen razón, me lógico pero no he escuchado que digan after the pandemic es poco lo que lo ocupan ok, keep it up, keep it up keep it up the video guy It's a, it's a, a target. What product? I'm sorry. Uh, the video game. A video uh, game. Sample. A video yeah. game could be a targeted sample. Why? Because for, it is for young people. It's for young people. It's for teenagers. Yeah. yeah. Or kids. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, but, yeah. I, but I'm an addict. I am an addict to a game. So. <laughs> no, but you are a conception. <laughs> yeah, but it's not for you. <laughs> no. <laughs> you can use it, but it's not for you. Okay. That's when, fair. When, when, when I go when I uh, for uh, a specific time, I was addicted to uh, a video game. To a video but, game. Yeah, but the, I think it's a normal when you when you have um it uh, between uh the ten ten years old uh uh to a a a a eighteen maybe. 18 years old, this you you have addiction, addiction you become, for the video, you will have addiction for the for the video game for I video games it's, yeah and, and it's, it's more it's, it's more for men than women right I don't see too many women playing video yeah. games yeah yeah the, the, actually there are there are uh, people all addiction for the video game there are old people or people with uh, addiction for video games yeah. yeah 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 i saw a lady i saw an old lady playing war what is it black black ops black ops um yeah black ops she was playing wars and black ops le, y, sí, le dicen la abuelita Grand, <laughs> grandma le dicen pero, man, se nos acaba todos. Es que era una ex militar, una ex francotiradora la señora. So, <laughs> tiros and everybody was like, what the? Oh, no, grandma is here. Grandma is here. Get, get out of here. Grandma is here. <laughs> yeah. So funny. Hey, but, uh, in, actually, in actually, in YouTuber, uh, mm -hmm. it's a normal, uh, it's, it's a normal, uh the 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 people their addiction for for the video because it's influencer they and become another, influencers uh-huh yes another another people to other people they become influencers yeah. to other people i've seen a lot of salvadorians becoming youtubers and yeah yeah Yeah, Pero, hablando, del, hablando del tema, ¿cuál es la diferencia en sí? No he logrado entender lo del target con with random. Ah, vaya, ok. Thank you for asking. A ver, targeted sample es un. Hablábamos de un muestreo de la población uh, objetivo que tiene tu producto. Si tú lo vas a lanzar, como están hablando ahorita, de un videojuego para niños nada más, ¿de qué edad? Sí. ¿De qué edad? 
Ah, pues de ese nicho, de ese grupo de personas vas a elegir. No vas a ir a agarrar gente de la calle que sea mayor de 18 años si es para niños el videojuego. Eso sería targeted. Si es random, el producto... Todo, todo, todo. Ajá, es, el producto puede ser un producto generalizado. O sea, cualquier persona lo puede utilizar. Entonces, por ende, ah. agarra de ese... Ese grupo. O sea, el, el target es como tengo un nicho ya específico, por ejemplo, adolescentes y de esos adolescentes puede agarrar la. la ah, sí, sí la totalmente. Clase. Porque estás, ah. lo que decía la primera pregunta de la clase, um, estás viendo, siendo, eh, tratando de. de sí, la clase. No, 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 de, predecir, era la palabra que ocupaba. De predict. O sea, predecir si tu, grupo, si tu producto va a tener éxito o no. Y solo lo puedes ah. hacer en base a la asunción de que el grupo de mercado al que va dirigido tu producto va a aceptar no sé. o no. Ya. Es sin pasos. Ah, ok. ¿Por qué se te toca hacer inglés? Man? Ok. Let's go. Present. Este, ok, ya, ya casi terminamos en resumen en un minuto. Esta es la hora de minuto del resumen de su clase. Este día hemos hablado sobre grupos focalizados de opinión. Es una estrategia para poder determinar o predecir si tu producto va a tener impacto o no, si va a ser bien aceptado o totalmente un fracaso. Y se hace a través de grupo, grupos foco, como decimos en, en español. Grupos foco, eh, hay dos tipos de grupos foco, como hemos visto ya lo último. Grupos target específicos o pueden ser grupos random, eh, al azar. Todo dependerá del nicho de mercado al que tu, tu producto va dirigido. Entonces, si tú elegís un target product, eh, perdón, un target uh, sample, que es un, un, un ejemplo bien específico, vas a elegir solo la población a la que va dirigida tu producto. ¿Ok? Va para niños de tal y tal edad, de ahí agarro para que prueben el producto. Uh, seguimos hablando de muestreo, ¿eh? Y luego está el random, que si tu producto es para todo tipo de edades, todo tipo de personas, pues de ahí vas a agarrar el, el, um, el, la, muestra. la muestra, el muestreo de la población que va a probar tu producto. That was the topic. Good. Let me do the attendance. We only have one minute and I'll see you tomorrow. Same time, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. Ada Azucena Cáceres Mendoza. Present. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Alan Christopher Abrego Brizuela. Present. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Claudia Marisela Solano Crespín. Okay. Edwin Arcides Iguizabal Martínez. Present. Night. Fátima y Fegenia López Ramos. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Isela Liliana Miranda Espinosa. Present. Good night. Good night. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. José Antonio Present. Cubías Hernández. Present. Juan Marcos Guzmán. Carla Yanet. Amaya Herrera. Miriam Carolina Mozo Valdés. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Present. Roberto Luis Sumaño Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Jocelyn Inés Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night, Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Good night, Good night, Rina Marisabel Álvarez de Chávez. Ok. Good night, guys. Take care. Eh, buenas noches. Solo un minuto. Le quería hacer una pregunta rápida. Yes, sir. Uh, escuché que dijo una expresión como... Yo le he escuchado en cursos que dicen como show we, ¿qué significa? Show we? Ah, no sé, pero es que lo, yo el curso que vi era de un, no sé, era como un, una persona europea que aprendió inglés británico y yo pensé que por el acento lo decía diferente y, o lo decía. Mira, lo hago por molestar, pero sí, eso es inglés arcaico, ya el show, ese modal, ese modal fue reemplazado por el will. Los británicos aún lo ocupan. Ah. Shall we? Es como, te damos. Veamos, ¿verdad? Lo hacemos. Lo hacemos. Uh 
-huh. Yo no entendía porque más que lo dice como Shelby, como que, como que no. En no realidad te... es como deberíamos. Ah. Y se ocupa mucho, muy cortésmente eso. Es decir, eh, para invitar a alguien a bailar, por ejemplo. Shall we dance? Ah, Shall okay. we? Es un modal arcaico, ok. Sí. Okay. Okay. Gracias, entonces, por la creación. Buenas noches. You're welcome. Good night. <ríe> ok, en su mal. Hey, what's up, Johnny? Primera vez que yeah. estamos en una sesión. No. Ya. Yeah. Sí, ¿verdad, Johnny? Ok, tranquilo, relax. Johnny, 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 si sí, solo tú, quiero ver. Ajá, si sí, no habíamos tenido, en la anterior no estabas en esta opción, ok. Súper bien, bien, mira, estas sesiones yo siempre me gusta iniciarlas con, con dos preguntas. Eh, ¿Ya habías estudiado inglés tú antes, Johnny, en otro curso, por tu cuenta o algo? ¿Sí? Sí, estaba estudiando en un curso los sábados, pero uh -huh. no terminé. ¿Hace cuánto? Como unos tres años. Ok. ¿Qué es lo que te, te motiva a aprender inglés? O sea, ¿de dónde salió esto de Voy a meter un curso en inglés? <ríe> Ajá. Un día iba... Eh, La como... publicación. No, iba, ta, iba viajando a, para Metapan, iba en un bus y se sentó un American people, <ríe> americano, conmigo y empezó a hablarme en, en Spanglish. En no intentó Ajá. hablarte en español. No, en inglés, no, so, en, en en serio, ok. Interesante. Entonces, de allí nació eso, como es que, porque no le pude, no le entendí nada. Y se me quedé con esa duda. ¿Y eso que hace cuánto fue? ¿Estabas pequeño o hace poco? No, ya estaba, creo que fue en el 2015. Hmm. Wow, ok, ok. Y ahí empezó la inquietud esa, ¿no? Ah, de, ¿por qué no puedo entender? O sea, mucho, mucho, digamos, de lo, por ejemplo, por ejemplo, o programas que la mayoría vienen en inglés, eh, uh -huh. las películas, subtítulos, como es posible. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Sí, sí, todos estamos bombardeados por el inglés, dijiste. ¿Cómo que no? Ajá, por ahí. Entender. Uh -huh. Ok. Sí. Ok. Y, y la, la otra pregunta, a ver, ¿qué estoy haciendo yo, Johnny? ¿Qué estoy haciendo aparte de recibir las dos horas de clase? ¿Estoy haciendo algo por estudiar algo extra o, o, o investigar o, o curiosear más en esto del inglés? ¿Tengo una rutina que sigo después de la clase o antes de la clase, durante el día? ¿Me he organizado en mi tiempo? ¿Qué has hecho para mejorar, aparte de recibir las clases? Um, trato de leer. He comprado tres libros. Uh -huh. ¿En inglés? En inglés. En inglés. Ok. ¿Y si los lees? Sí. No, o sea, de, vez en cuando, de vez en cuando. No, no. Esto... Casi todas las noches tengo Ajá. que leer una página. Por lo menos una página de uno de los libros. O sea, no, ah, no, te, no te estreses, ¿verdad? porque los tres libros, una página de cada libro todas las noches. <risa> Sería demasiado. Sí, pero me parece... Pero solo una página, incluso casi la mitad de una página, porque existen muchas palabras que me toca irlas a buscar. Excelente. O sea que tú empezás a leer... Y ya cuando te topas y decís, no, esta palabra no la conozco, y ves hacia atrás de la lectura, adelante de la lectura, porque así, esa es la mejor uh, técnica que puedes ocupar. Vas leyendo y te encontrás con una palabra que no entendés, la marcas, seguí leyendo. Si lo que está delante de la palabra y atrás no te da una idea, entonces sí, a buscar qué dice, qué quiere decir esa palabra. Ya. 
ok, me quedo solo con lo que leí y investigué. No, le escribo ahí en letra pequeña arribita. Yo bueno, siempre también. Le, le, escribo, le escribo ahí el significado a la par, ahí con uh -huh. lápiz pequeñito, por si lo leo otra vez, aunque me recuerde. Súper bien, súper bien. Eso es una buena técnica, de hecho, a utilizar la lectura. En lo otro son las, las canciones. ¿Qué canciones? Me gusta electrónica, fade away, por ejemplo. <laughs> Use fade away. <laughs> fade and, uh, ok, good. Eh, si te gusta la música, hay una, uh, hay una aplicación que es bastante adictiva, eso sí, en mi caso me encantó esa aplicación. Este se llama lyricstraining.com. Ahorita, no sé si estás en el celular o en la compu. Bueno, a ver, ahí está el link. Este, bueno, eso es para, para el, la compu, ¿verdad? Ahí le puedes dar go to web uh -huh. arriba y te va a abrir una biblioteca. Esto prácticamente es, bueno, puedes empezar con el modo karaoke y solo ir viendo la letra. Si no te la puedes bien en la canción, pero o sea, no, no has escuchado suficientemente. Luego te puedes ir a retarte y empezar a practicar. El chiste de esta aplicación es que te va dejando espacios en blanco en la letra y tú los puedes ir eligiendo. ¿Qué palabra sigue? ¿Qué palabra ah. sigue? Si te equivocas, no pasa nada. Se detiene la canción. Pero va ganando puntaje arriba. Okay. Okay. Y tiene una biblioteca bien extensa. Y es no, música porque... tranquila. Tengo una aplicación también. Se llama... Esa sí me gusta porque... Se llama. Duolingo. Free, free for toe. Free for toe. No me suena. De verdad. ¿Y qué? Pero este, este fuerza. O sea, puedo armar grupos. Pues me reúno con. Mi... De, ah, free for, free for talk, free for yeah, talk, free for talk, free for talk. Yeah. Ah, y empiezas claro. a, a tener grupos de conversación. Ah, grupos de conversación. Y qué chivo, y eso, um, o sea, por medio de chat, como que estés escribiendo, o videollamada. No, o sea, hablamos videollamada. Wow, y es gente del de Salvador o de varios países. Mm, más que todo de Asia. Sí, de verdad. Qué asiático. Hey, me llega, me llega. ¿Te eh, gusta hablar con, con gente extranjera? Ya, me, ma, me gusta hablar con, con people de other. From country. other countries. <risa> yeah. hey, good, good job. Ok. Tal vez sale algo, Ayon. <risa> Por ahí. Oh, sí, ahí conversamos con ladies. <risa> Súper bien. Española. Yo, yo tenía española. 25 años cuando conocí una sueca. Trabajaba en el cine reforma, imagínate. Conocí una sueca y, y la vi desde que la dije. Esta mujer no es americana. Porque no, no estaba toda quemada por el sol. Andaba bien peinada, con un vestido bien, bien pegado. No andaba en sandalias. O sea, andaba en sandalias de mujer, pero no en sandalias de que venía de la playa. Así como la mayoría americana es que... Uy, hermano, todas quemadas, con las sandalias todas sucias. O sea, se nota, pues. Y lo chistoso es que me puse a hablar con ella y empezaba a hablar inglés. No hablaba tan fluido. No, pues fue antes entonces, como 18 años tenía. La cosa es de que al final le pedí el correo electrónico. Empezaba aquello del messenger, ¿verdad? Y me dijo que se llamaba Erika, punto Molina, no sé qué. Y le escribí después. Y resulta que una colombiana me contestó. Sí, era demasiado <risa> bueno para ser verdad. Pero bueno. La vida, la vida. Estamos eh. con una colombiana y una venezolana que. <risa> Pero eso lo te dicen. En inglés me hablas. Tú me hablas en inglés. <risa> que son matados en chiste. Hey, muy bien, te felicito la verdad, porque si tú rompes este miedo y empezás a hablar con un montón de gente, eso hacía yo hablaba con deportados, de gente así y me gustaba que me corrigieran 
que me dijeran, aún costándome hablar, esto y esto tienes que corregir. Las americanas, una vez una viejita, ya mayor, me, me agarré y me dijo, me enseñó sobre auxiliares y todo un día en el cine, ahí trabajaba y, y fui, se tomó el tiempo la señora, de verdad. No, Te no, digo, no, o sea, que lo corrigen a uno de los egipcios. Eso, nunca he hablado con un egipcio. También, ¿no? He hablado con hindú, he hablado con, con egipcios. Aquí. Wow. Ok, bueno, buena suerte con eso, seguirle haciendo ganas. Cualquier cosa, ahí estoy, escribime si necesitas algún consejo, ahí. Súper bien, Johnny. Okay, okay. Good night. Okay. Take care. Good night, Jim. Ok, gracias.